Hey everyone, welcome to Artery Gear Fusion. So, we're going to be tackling today the don'ts of this game as early as the third day. Okay, so these are the don't do's. I've been doing this myself for the past few days and I just realized that these are the things that you don't do, period. So, I don't know if you guys have been doing this or you're still doing this or you've stopped doing this, but as of this video, please stop doing these. Okay, so starting off with number one, let us go to the team. Um, don't spread your resources very thin okay do not level up as many uh as many as you can like what i did i have here a lot well you know you, we're still you know we're still starting out but have have a core team with uh, with uh, with the three elements that we have green red and blue so and 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 focus on that if you have a new one then replace like nemophilia i replaced her with um, with sirius because i got her yesterday but do focus on your core team of four probably a maximum of six because these three here will be your core units um, for the lower rarities, Alice, Grace, and Morris. These three here are indispensable at this time, especially that we, all of us, are beginning this game. So the, the rest would be your damage dealers here, which I have here, Sirius, uh, Sh Sh Shayura, and Jinja. So again, don't spread your resources, especially if... Um, you want to concentrate on bringing them up to level to to six star, and leveling them up to sixty. Uh, you have to concentrate on building their gear, especially the resources for their gear, technology as well, um, resources and raising up technology, and also the upgrades for them if you have upgrades for them. So again. Don't spread your resources at least four, five, or six if you are, you know, if you have a lot of resources, then go for six. But for for me, it, I'm, I'm actually focusing on the six at this point. So again, it's a terrible mistake to redistribute all of your resources all around <laughs> all of your figures. I know you, you, you like to level up most of them, but at this point, um, it's a no-no. So again, moving on to the next. Okay, so if you guys are familiar, we are leveling up father already. Father is F-O-D-D-E-R, not father. Okay, so um, if you're leveling up a couple of fathers here, let me just show you guys. So I have here this one. So if um, you want to upgrade this one to four star, definitely let's uh, choose something first. Definitely don't use the waifus. Don't use the human human slash mecha <laughs> mecha. If even if you have extra, don't use them. Please just use the same regular um what they call this regular um mechs here. So that you can, you know, um, these do not give you currency if you sell them. So these are the best to sacrifice in upgrading. So please do not use, again, again, just want to go back. Do not use the, the waifus, the human slash mechas. Use the, these common robots here. These common mechs, not even these. Don't use them in 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 breakthrough. Save the um, the alpha alphors. So the, only these common robots can be used to what they call this to upgrade. So let's do the upgrade. Let's do one upgrade. One, two, three. Okay. So there you go. Okay. Also, guys, um, if I if you haven't noticed this, one of the biggest mistakes that I did as well is missing on this quick star up here. So if you click this, this is a quick star up of all the generic robots that you have for star up. 
so that you won't go through them one by one. Um, at this point, I don't want to do this, but you can do this on a massive scale. So again, don't forget, you have this option here. Then we'll go to the battle system. But before the battle system, let's go to the team for to set up our auto. Okay, so this is my farming team at this point. I have I have to bring up Jinja to 48. I have to replace these two. But um, one thing that I should mention, please do set this up. Um, I really was really... I really didn't, didn't remind this. I saw this earlier, but I didn't think that this would be a big deal. But it is. So set this up um for alice it is 213 uh for the 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 bonus turn you can actually select whether she's gonna prioritize um somebody or someone in your team um you can randomly do that but it's best that you set somebody for now i'm setting it as the with the higher attack stat so that's it so don't forget to set this you can also set this you can also set this while um in battle so i'm gonna show you guys where just in case you don't know where it is let's go to the event now the asura because i want to replace my farming team uh here Gonna replace these guys here with the ones that I need to level up. And another one. Okay. So once you're here, obviously, you have to set these. Uh, set these to the max. Check your energy before you do energy refill because you might have not. Uh, you might not have enough energy so you can check it here and you, i still have 13 so let's go in back um challenge again when fail no no set these actually as well then begin battle and um, while you're in battle later you can set these so there are a lot of things that i really missed that i regret i missed for the past two days but i don't you know it's, it's not a problem. So you can also set it here depending on, let's say, if you want to set uh, for graces skill, you can also set it here. So you can set it while you're playing. And also this one. Um, this actually was my problem. This used to be blank. So my problem was um, it didn't, the, the support, AG did not do anything because this was blank. So please do um, select this. Usually for these stages, I would just select this guy, the third one to your right. Then also don't forget to put this on off. Oops. I'll go back to that later. So this is going to reset. Okay. So going back, going back to that, this one, guys. Do not turn this on because when you turn this on, this is going, they're going to only use their, you know, their active skill only on boss encounter. So click this on off so that all of them can use their active skill in any battle up until the boss. So that's it. So you can actually set it here that was actually my biggest problem and it's a big difference when you set that up already um i forgot to mention one thing let's uh, let's go back to let's just uh confirm this and uh let's do a setting again i forgot to mention earlier so if you are here as i mentioned in my previous video if you do ai combat um we don't have the luxury of clearing this with clear tickets so the only thing that we could do is do an offline battle uh if you're saving on time if you're working while you're doing this while you're farming you can do offline battle once you begin battle 
then you can exit this and then do whatever things you do. For me, I play other games while this farms. I just go back to it after probably 15 minutes, 20 minutes and check again. So the offline thing is actually a big deal when it comes to farming. So please do that. Please don't miss that as well. Because again, this will save you uh, um, your battery once you grind for farming. Okay, so let's just... Uh, Let's uh, go out for a bit for this one. And uh, let's just finish the last stage. Let's just uh, leave battle. Because I'm gonna... Don't, don't want to waste your time, guys. And uh, the one want to go to the last two parts of the Don't Miss video. So in terms of farming here... Uh, one other thing is that my mistake, I missed to farm the first day and this was open on the, thir the, on the first day um, for the red. Um, I missed this. I should have done this because Morris was out on the second day. Actually, I had Morris already in the first day. I didn't know that this was crucial. So I missed this. So please do this on a daily basis so that um, you would have enough for your future um, artery gears to be to be leveled up um, in terms of this resources. So this one is very crucial. Uh, now it's blue. Tomorrow it's going to recycle back to red. So don't forget this. This is a big no-no if you skip a day because, again, you will be skipping two days instead if you don't farm for a specific element. Okay, and the last one, which I think you don't need now, but you'll be needing in the future, not this one. So do this, guys, daily as well. Um, capture cat orbs, look for the bonus here, bounty mission, but most especially this one, the forbidden uh, blue mist zone. You will need these, these guys. These are called UE, unique equipment for your unique equipment farming. So you ev you'll eventually need these. So you might have been asking, where will I use these? So the best way to farm these is um, this. You have a three chance. Either you do two here and one here or two here and one here. So do, do not farm stage three at this point. You can farm either stage one and stage two. So <clears throat> that's it. So this this is future you know future resources that you will need that you need to farm now because once the the unique equipment drops you guys are going to cry if you don't have those resources. So those are my don't do's for artery gear as early as now. Don't do those skip those bad habits and learn to have uh, good habits from here on. So Thank you guys for staying this far. Hopefully this um, video was able was helpful to you. And uh, I'll see you in the next one. Uh, but before that, please do subscribe. Thank you guys. Take care. This is The Warden and I'm out of here.